many of us have done it, used a phone while on the road. But thanks to Senate Bill 301, using a phone for anything other than answering a call or using it as a GPS is a finable offense. SB 301 expands a pre-existing law that makes it illegal to text and drive and for anyone under 18 years old to use a phone while driving. Texting and driving was prohibited in the state of Alabama. This is aiming to exclude having the phone in your hand for any other purpose because a lot of the arguments with the texting was, I wasn't texting, I was entering a phone number. I wasn't texting, I was picking up a phone call. The new bill also deems it illegal to physically hold a phone, right? send or read text messages, watch or record a video while driving, or reach for any electronic device that forces the driver to lift up from their seat. After June of 2024, fines will be added. It's a $50 fine to start with, then it goes on to 100, 150, and points will also be taken off your driver's license. There are some important caveats to the bill. For example, drivers can still use Bluetooth and use a single swipe to answer a phone call. No hands-on devices at all. Just to clarify, being caught using your phone while driving is a secondary violation, meaning police can't stop someone for being on the phone. They can, however, stop someone for a traffic violation and then charge the driver for using a phone. Now this of course excludes texting because texting is a primary offense and I don't have to have another reason if I see you continuously on the phone. The new law has gone into effect already, meaning law enforcement, including TUPD, can enforce it. We want our students and drivers to be the safest that they can. Belle Johnson, Troy, Trojan Vision News.